Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to the stream. Uh, grab bag tonight, followed by a demo that I'm very excited to check out because it's a game I've been following for like a long time. And they got a demo out, so I want to try that. Um, what, you didn't like that music? Only Chinese kids from the 80s will get that song. Uh, anyway, this isn't the hugest grab bag I've ever had. It is 12 games, so, you know, I'll give you my regular little warning for grab bags. Uh, I don't really screen these games, so, you know, epilepsy warning, uh, content warning, they could have offensive shit in them, um, volume warning, they could be really loud. I don't really know, so let's explore them together. Uh, but welcome to the stream, and let's, let's, let's go, let's go. I don't need no warning, Mike. Some people might. Listen, there's no shame in that. I need warnings when there's going to be a loud noise. The first game in my list is called Final Fantasy vs. Dog. That's a, that's a title. All right. Well, let's get started then. Where are you? And it's going to take some setup time, so also be prepared for that. Final Fantasy vs. Dog. Moonbumbo, thank you for the sub. I think this is it. I think this is Final Fantasy vs. Dog. Uh, let me turn the desktop audio down a bit before I start it up. And Mechanical Enid, or Mecha <laughs> Mechanical End and Admiral, thank you very much for the subs too. Must be sub season. Alright, let's. Okay. Sure. Off to a great start. I, I guess we're off to a great start then. Dog will win. No, he won't. I'm gonna fucking. I'm gonna beat him. I got, uh, damages and poisons enemies. Pac Man Trinity, thank you for the sub. He's doing a fucking idle animation for an RPG. Yeah, this is just a joke about idle animations, but I'm okay with it. Uh... Also, Cecil's the protagonist of Final Fantasy IV. I fucking love that game. I haven't played it in ages. How can you possibly defeat the dog? He's too strong. I'm going to die. I have Fatal. You can't beat the dog! He's invincible. You literally cannot beat this dog. I don't understand how you would even possibly do it. Looks like I'm done for. Kane, don't count yourself out. Oh, Kane's here! Crash, thank you for the sub. For Rosa. Oh, I remember these characters. Holy shit, I haven't played this since it came out on the DS. Alright, uh, jump. Yeah, sure, do that. Keep going. This game has everything. It has dramatic, you know, entrances of characters. It has old friends, old references. The most amazing graphics I've ever seen, honestly. What the fuck did I just join in on? It's Final Fantasy vs. Dog. Fucking... Do you read video game websites? Jeez. Uh, yeah, there's not gonna be a whole lot of downtime for conversation in the middle of a grab bag, so I'll ask you guys how you're doing a little later. Yeah, this is great. It's a great game. I think, uh, Dark is his best attack. Maybe just attack. No, that does 36. He's gotta do jump. Kane, you gotta do jump. We gotta use Dark and jump. Honestly- Oh, wait, what the fuck is he doing? Oh, no. It's his limit break. <laughs> Limit break. I can't beat him. What is Jesus Christ? <laughs> I can't beat him. Cecil's dead. Jesus Christ. Come on, Kane. You can do this. I just gotta keep using jump with Kane. That's all I can do. I gotta keep using high potions and jump. That's gonna kill me. It does 309. I'm dead. Oh, wait, he held on. How? High potion, go. 
Did I use it on s okay, got that's good, that's good. Get another jump in there. Please. Go, 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 go! Yes! This dog fucking is the toughest boss in any Final Fantasy. I'm not interested in Final Fantasy 15, but I am interested in Final Fantasy versus dog. Get him! Fucking get him! We did it! That's gotta be it. Stop! God! Oh, I guess this means we're dog food. It's been nice knowing you, Kane. No! Stay away! I don't remember this character. I don't remember this character. I don't. What? Genuinely. Uh, two. Learn how to make better RPG Maker games. Honestly, very, very good game. I'm not gonna play that because I'll get a copyright strike. Uh, Taco, thank you for the sub. Alright, well, that was a great start. I think that that's the end of the grab bag, honestly. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. That was Final Fantasy vs. Dog. Um, alright. Next up is Fox Flares. Fox Flares. You guys want to play fo Fox Flares? Oh, look, at there's good music. Where is the game? There it is. Sun Bunny sent me this one. LD40. The more you have, the worse it is. I believe it would be the worse it is, but... Ah, let's give it a try. Let's give it a try. Am I on fire? Do you- do you like- oh fuck, okay. Oh jeez, oh jeez. This is actually kind of neat. Okay, so you're like a fire fox. And when you step in- in like bush, you get on fire. Oh fuck. How do you- there's gotta be a double jump. There's gotta be a double jump. Oh fuck, ah! This is actually a neat idea and it's very cute. Yeah, I like it. Okay. I'm gonna die. No! No! Fox, no! I actually like this. I always feel bad- This is the type of game I feel bad for when we do grab bags, because it's great. And everything else is like... A, a shit post in game form. But this is like a genuinely cute little game that has a neat premise. What I wanna know is why this dog keeps lighting on fire when he leaves the puddle. Also, we have two dog games in a row. Foxes are dogs. This is the beauty of grab bags. What, wait, what, what exactly causes these to fuck? Oh, God, no! Dog, no! Dolphins, thank you very much for the sub. I can't wait for the next dog game. I hope there's another dog game. Oh, funk! Ooh. This is neat. This is very neat. Aren't foxes cats? No. Raccoons are cats in The Sims 4, apparently. From what I've heard, you can crossbreed... Look at his face when he's about to burn up. Apparently, you can crossbreed uh, cats and raccoons in The Sims 4 pets. That's what I've heard. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I love keyboard platformers. Yeah. Foxes are vulpes. Is that why it's called Vulpix? Vulpix. Vulpies. Hello? Are there any Vulpies in here? Does anybody know what a Vulpies are? Oh, fuck. Bounce blocks. Raccoons are just trash cats. You can crouch. How do I make these activate? Oh! Oh, Jesus Christ! I'm a Vulpy. Vulpy sounds like a bad word. I don't want to say it anymore. At this point, I'm going to have to ask the entire stream to stop using the term Volpi. 
Oh, I gotta show you guys a picture I found, too, when I was looking for grab bag games. I came across this one that I'm- it's just an anomaly. It's really weird. Also, in other news, I'm using new headphones tonight. Because remember how I was saying that my old headphones that I was using were electrocu uh, electrocuting the inner part of my head? Because my static powers became too strong and whenever I moved around while wearing the headphones it electrocuted me? Well today it electrocuted me really really bad and then the left earbud just stopped working entirely. So I'm using new ones. I have to learn to control my powers. It actually really hurt too. Also, I can't do this part. I got zapped so hard that my headphones stopped working. Okay, this part's too hard. I might have to move on. But I won't, because I have so many- I have so many not too many games tonight, so you know, I can take my time with this. Oh, oh, yes, yes! <sighs> no, I'm not gonna go to the next game. I only got 12 games tonight, or 13 games. I won! These are my family! Hey, everybody! Have you seen my family? See, I told you. I told you I could do it. This is a good game. What an excellent game. I'm gonna leave this on screen for a second while I find that picture that I wanted to show you. I believe I just saved it to my pictures folder. Where was it? Where was it? Uh, this is a good one, guys. It's a real good, okay. So I was looking on, I believe this is either itch.io or Game Jolt, but uh, there was this one. I didn't download it because it looks very suspicious. There were a lot of games around this edition of Mario Kart that had this exact same thumbnail, so I didn't download it. Like, there were a zillion games with that exact screenshot of the wolf, but the one that was titled Mario Kart really drew me in. I don't know why. This first game, or I guess technically the third game, is called 3D Cactus Garden 3D. 3D Cactus Garden 3D, huh? We haven't seen anime Bear Grylls in a while. I actually edited him into the last grab bag on YouTube because there was a... There was a... I think there was a vagina in that one. Alright, uh... 3D Cactus Garden 3D. I think that's a goat. Are goats associated with cactuses? Cacti? Let's go. Let's do that. Alright. Press. All right, we're off to a great start tonight here. Is that a cactus? Yeah, we're off to an amazing start. What is he? Is he like... That is a cactus. Gardened, one out of 18. Killed, two. Well, you- what do you mean, gardened, one out of 18, killed, two? Oh, is this hot, hot, hot? In midi form? Wait, but now it says gardened, one out of 17. So, am I killing them? You can't run, this is entirely arrow keys. There's no mouse or- What is the platform up there? What's the point? I'm so confused. Two out of 14. I mean, I- I should try to get them all. That's heaven up there? You think? Heaven, heaven is just a fucking polygon in the sky. What was that? I just heard a ha ha! Wait, are they trying to get into the shade or something? I can't run. There's no run. It's just arrow keys. This is what dying feels like. This is what dying feels like. That sounds like a Tom and Jerry sound effect. Yeah, it sounds like Tom and Jerry or... Hold on. Could be Danny DeVito, too. I don't know. I think some of them are getting away. 
It says killed 10. I missed that one. This game has an extra spicy aura to it. I think the ground texture really... Oh, hear that? Hear that whistle? The ground texture is very, very good. Hi, everybody. Yeah, streaming... Uh, I think I want to start streaming earlier. Like, this is a good time, because then I'll be done at, like, 11 o'clock. And then I don't have to fucking stay up till 5 in the morning. Use your tongue like in other goat game. Alright, yeah, I'm definitely, like, removing cacti from play. Because the number... It's like 3 out of 5 now. The ground looks like Monster Hunter on the 3DS. <laughs> yeah, it does. It does. Alright, so where are these last cactuses? I won't anymore. No, I promise I won't. Oh, there's one. There you are, you fuck. Get back here. There's two of them. I see two of them. That's it. Those are the last two. Three out of five. This is going to be four out of five and five out of five. Let's go. Three out of four, I guess. Or we could go the other way. Yeah. This is the last one. What's going to happen? What's going to happen? Is the music too loud? I can turn it down a little bit. All right. Oh, it starts over now. Oh, it starts over now. That's great. Okay, off to a great start. Um, <laughs> you killed someone. Yeah, there's a mystery there. I can't wait for 3D Cactus Garden 3D 2. Uh, next up is called Boolean Escape. Boolean. 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 B-O-O-L-E-A-N. Is that a word? What does Boolean mean? Can someone please explain? Also, it's... I clicked it. It's not loading. Bowling... No. It's true or false. True or false. Okay. Well, I didn't know that. Can I, la can I launch the game? It's a coding term. It means true or false. True or false. Will this game launch? I'm going to say false. Actually, I'm going to guess it's going to launch two times. While we wait, did I show you guys this? What the fuck is wrong with Ryu's feet? It looks like they're made of plastic. They look like the Hulk's feet. What is ha what happened to him? All right, anyway, yeah, it loaded. Okay, um Boolean escape. I don't know why that took so long to load. Hopefully that won't be a, a thing that happens. Oh boy. Can we make it not full screen? All right, can we capture the window, please? There it is. Boolean escape. Well, I can't see chat now. Listen, game game grab bag, you have to cooperate with me here. Now I can't see the fucking equalizer. There we go. Boolean escape by Dan Sanderson. By Danderson. He should just change his name to make it easier. There's like this weird fisheye thing going on with the camera, and it's fucking weirding me out. I bought Viva Pinata today because of your streams, and I love it. Thank you for showing me the game, because I had no idea it was good. Well, I'm glad that you liked it. Light. LMB to toggle light switch. Waz the keys, thank you for the sub, and thank you for being of use to me in this game. Oh, I don't like that. I don't want to go in there. Ugh. Yeah, it's a lot of, it's a very low res game. Hello. See what I mean? It's like warping his face. He looks like he's going, huh. Oh, there's another switch. Button. Oh, now he's a different guy, and there's a new thing. Okay. I can't read that. This is what it feels like to not have glasses on. Can you find a key? Combination safe. I, I don't know. Can I? Where would it be? Where would it be? 
this key that I don't see. Look, someone, someone pissed on a carpet. I can't see a key. It's too dang pixely. Numpad to unlock. Do you think like the the computer numpad? Because that's just gonna make my meme buttons go off. You know that feeling when you're. Oh no, guys! I can't I can't press these keys without the meme buttons going off. You know that feeling when you're running for your life. <laughs> I can't do it. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. I knew fucking making my numpads into meme buttons would come back to haunt me someday. Alright, what if because this light is on now, I can turn this one on? Oh, look at that. Hello? This wall doesn't look right. This wall looks like it's not attached to everything. This is making me dizzy. What the f- Is this allowed? Blood. I hope this game isn't scary. Uh, blood. Yeah. This is actually kind of neat, but it's going to scare me. Nandoto. Uh, Hello? Why is it on the floor now? What happened? This is kind of neat. Oh. Oh. Guys, there's this new video I keep I keep referencing. There's this dude who's like in a trailer and he's talking through a hand puppet. His hand has like googly eyes on it and he goes, Let's see what dwells in the depths of my trailer. And then he opens this little hatch, and there's a there's a toy Garfield inside. And then he goes, "Whoa!" Uh oh, I didn't want to go in here. This is like Silent Hill. Eh. Let's see what dwells in the depths of this elevator. Whoa! This is kind of neat, but I'm scared. I'm stuck in here. Oh, f oh, what the fuck? How did that happen? Yo, this is very frightening. I don't like this. Eh? Oi. Oi, what the fuck then? Nandoto. Eh? This is kind of neat. But I know something's going to spook me. Hmm. Can I interact with this? That's my favorite song. That was me pressing a button. Haha. <laughs> Oi, mister, you meet that? This is kind of neat, like it's engaging. Guys, I'm confused, hold on. The memes tonight seem quieter than usual. I don't know. What do you want from me? What do you want from me, huh? I give you memes and they're not loud enough? Oh. Oh boy, I can't wait to be fucking lowered into a chamber of death. Okay. Hey. Guys, this game is making me a little sleepy. This game is making me a little tired. What the hell was even the point of that code box? This... Okay. Yeah, sure. I got owned, I guess. Hey, in the gaming world, we like to call that getting owned. Is it gonna happen again? Huh! But I backed up! I backed up that time, though! Oh, I got fucking beamed again! 
Got fucking pwned. When did people stop using the word pwned? Wait, maybe, hold on. There must be something else. Hold on, hold on, there's a switch there. If I hit this first, then hit this, then go in here, I bet I'll be safe. I get out, I bet I'll be safe. Ha! That's what I thought, that's what I thought. Look at that. Here we are. Three. Three. That's a number on the code. Three is the button that I press to make Hotel Mario play. Oh. Whoa! 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 I don't think this is getting me anywhere. This music is upsetting me. Whoa! Guys, I'm confused. I don't know what this wants from me. I'm stuck in this room. There's music? Yeah, it's like going... Yeah, there's like a, a low droning thing. It's like... Just go? Just go where? What do you mean just go? The floor? What do you mean go the floor? It's a different room? Is this allowed? Mike, just go. I'm trying to go. Just go under there, guys. Just go, idiot. What the heck's wrong with- Wait, okay. Three. Lizard man. There's desert. Oh, that's desert. Hey, guys. You guys from- Okay, I'm about done with this game. I'm about done with this fucking tomfoolery. Are you kidding me? Yo, I need Vivian. Go, 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 go. Fucking idiot. You're safe here. There's, there's safe spots. Okay. Okay, well, all the buttons are pressed. What is Panutes died on stream? Okay, good, good comment. What is this? Four? Three, four. That makes this noise. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Key creation. I made a foul key. I made a foul key. Okay. What, set lock? Did you take that Gronk cutout? I thought that was Tom Brady. But no, I didn't take it. Set a key code. Okay, no key. Sure. Are you sure about that? Yes, I am sure about that. Are we done? Without a key, you can never escape. All right, thanks for playing. Yeah, thanks. That was great. I had a great time with that one. Uh, next up is a game called FPS version 0.68. Should have waited for the next version. Because that would have been the funny number. Alright, well... Why is this also taking a long time to load? What's the... What's the... What's the dealio with this? Are, are Unity games taking a long time to load? What's going on with my CPU? Nothing. Everything's fine. Why are these taking so long to load? I don't want to have to look at this picture of Ryu while I wait for every game. They look like rocks. They look like rocks. This is net neutrality at its worst. All right, well. 
fuck feet McMike. I'm waiting, FPS version 0 0.68. Maybe I should launch as, like, an administrator. Uh, fucking, uh... Oh, there it is. Look at that. Can you guys see it? Look at that. It worked. Oh. The Spy Who Shot Me. Starring Agent 7. Okay. I better report in. Was that me talking? I better report in? I might have to turn this up a little bit. Oh, fuck. I'm sorry. This is nice music. Did you enjoy your flight, Commander? Okay, she just hides, I guess. What is this guy doing? Sure. Try not to shoot up the office, Mr. Seven. All right. Nukes stolen. Holy shit. I suppose that's that's for me to 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 figure out and solve. Beware, Agent Seven is about uh. that. What did I just do? I right clicked and he went, huh? Huh? You can't huh. even spam it. You have to. It has like a cooldown. Huh? Huh? See you on the field, Seven. Yo, you can make him do lunges. Huh? Huh? Oh, it's a sprint button. Shift also does it. Elena, thank you very much for the sub. Huh? I like this stream time. I like starting at like seven. I thought those were dudes in like a shower and they were naked. Jesus Christ. Shadow Man, thank you for the sub too. Guys, I'm pissed off because it's my sister's birthday soon, and I ordered her a tiny-headed kingdom elephant for, for her birthday because elephants are her favorite animal, or second favorite animal, and it says it's not going to be here till after her birthday. I'm, bu I'm upset. What do you want? Oh my god. No crazy inventions today, Smithers. We're still repairing your last escapade. You should install brakes next time. Nonsense, Seven. The only fault is with the driver. Regardless, it's time for your annual checkup. Oh my god. <laughs> it's time for your annual checkup. Go to the shooting range to begin your training. Good luck. Now, where did Smithers put that training course? I just, I just completed the training course. <laughs> what is this game? This is so strange. DJ Shithead, thank you very much for the sub. I appreciate it. I love you too. It's this. I, I already did it. What do you want from me, Smithers? Oh. Okay. I mean, is there supposed to be good guys? Am I not supposed to shoot some of them? This is kind of neat. I can see this being fun. It's very retro feeling. Do you guys see this the shooting skill I've got going on right now? Could you just like fucking like what the hell, dude? They should hire me on special forces. Special victims unit SVU. Bum bum. Looks like the Vic didn't even have legs. How many of them do I have to shoot? I'm ready for this to end. Man, GoldenEye64 has not aged well. I did it, I won. Accuracy 91. Won't Smithers be pleased that I passed? I thought he was gonna be dead when I got back. Wish a miracle you passed. Next time make a harder call, Smithers. These voices, man. Yeah, you'll need this for your You'll next need this! And is your parachute even you could use? What I accent is this? I better report in to mother. Mother? 
Mike, where's the rest of the grab bag on YouTube? Where's Final Fantasy vs. Dog? I'm splicing it together with this grab bag. So if you're watching this on YouTube, you already saw Final Fantasy vs. Dog. Where the hell is Mother? Mother. Oh, okay, thanks. That's good. That's convenient when you ask where something is and there's just an arrow pointing to it. This reminds me of, like, Black Mesa. Game of the fucking year, honestly. Like, what the hell? This is great. Alright. By and large, the best game so far. Labs, exit. My character is very slidey, though. There's a puzzle here. I bet I can pick this up. Huh? huh? Why is the resolution fucked up on Twitch? Is it just my stream, or is it everyone's stream? I didn't change anything. Am I streaming at a lower resolution? With your paperwork, Seven, honestly. That takes care of my paperwork. That takes care of my paperwork. See you on the field, Seven. I see you on the field. Beware, Agent Seven is about... Looks fine for me. Alright, some people are saying Twitch is fucked today. Wait, I just went around in a big dang circle! Where the heck is, is- where's Mommy? Mommy, that's gotta be you. Mother will see you now, Mr. Seven. Where are you? There you are. Can that's- see this? That's not that's a guy. That's a man. It's a man named Mother? Doing a spot of redecorating, sir. My paintings have a nasty habit of attracting bullet holes. I don't suppose you'd know anything about that. I wouldn't know, sir. Moths, perhaps. Moths, Whatever okay. Whatever the case, Seven, this nuclear malarkey is serious business. Mission 2. Scum are planning on blowing up the White House with our stolen nuke. Infiltrate the White House basement, Seven. There should be a comma there. And get back our nuclear device. Good luck, Agent Seven. I mean, that kind of escalated very quickly. You see the number on there? Oh my god. Oh no! Oh no! Oh my god, this is just down under Dan! I forgot to pick up the fucking surfboard! It's not opening! <laughs> Who the hell is this dude? <laughs> Smash <him. laughs> He didn't even look to see if he was okay! I gotta get to that bomb and fast! I gotta get to that bomb and fast! I gotta turn it down a little bit now. The volume's all over the place. Scum. Fuck you, scum. This is a trap. That looks like a fish. That doesn't look like a nuke. It looked like a goldfish. Yo, this is a great game. I actually like this a lot. Why does that say seven? Is this like a save point? What's up, hero? Welcome to the stream. I know it's early, but I'm, I'm kind of liking this. I don't know. I felt like it. I felt like streaming early, and I'm glad I did. But don't expect me to go as late as usual. I'm still planning on four to five hours, so... There's so much auto-aim in this game, it's easy. Alright. Yeah, this is like GoldenEye, just better, I guess. Because in GoldenEye, there's no huh button. I mean, where the... It said this way, so maybe I, I was supposed to... Fuck you. Yeah, there we go. Don't even have to... I mean, they can. They genuinely can. I should bring a gun next time, boys. So, uh, what's going on with you guys today? This is some downtime. What's what's new in your lives? How are you? Tell me. Tell me about your lives. You don't got me. Why are you just bringing wrenches? I don't understand. This music's actually all right. Why don't they have guns? Because they thought wrenches would be enough. My date canceled on me last minute. That sucks. I'm sorry to hear about that. You don't need them anyway. Oh my god. Alright. That's fucking... That's impressive. That's some peak performance. Holy shit. Look at... 
This guy is fucking great. I had to zoom out to make the resolution work, and I cannot read this tiny chat. There she blows. Well, let's hope not. Well, let's hope not. There's gonna be a boss here. Health tonics. Ha! 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 Yeah, maybe pop out chat? I don't know. It's almost done. Then we're gonna go. I got it now, I guess. Agent 6, you're going too slow. Oh, I got a shotgun. That's not a shotgun. This is a machine gun. See ya. You only need to hit them with one bullet. There's no point. This doesn't have a point. Because the other gun shoots so fast anyway. I mean, do I go... No, not that way. It's this way. I guess I'm just leaving Agent 6. Is he okay? He's like half worm. Boz, thank you for the sub. Ugh. Uh-oh. It's the king of scum. Wow, he died so easily. Okay. Bye. I think I beat this game. Digi, thank you for the sub. Who the hell are you? Who the hell are- Is that Bush? What? He talked like Bush. Security! Security! <laughs> what? President really took a shine. Guys, I think I'm done with this. Oh. I feel like this is long. I need I to go on. Major Smith is looking for you, sir, at the labs. I need to. I need to go to the next game. Security. I need to go to the next game. I can't do this. I just. All right. Let me go see this dude, and then I'll go to the next game. I believe Major Smithers. Oh, Major yeah. Smithers. Smithers. Uh, hello, sir. It's me, Major Smithers. Hello. Uh. Uh. Oh, seven. Behold my Those are shoes. Those are shoes. Those are just... Just... technology shoes. Don't tell me. You glued some springs on a shoe. Person seven. Now take these and report to mother. Apparently, there might be a 17th Colossus in the Shadow of the Colossus remake. Isn't that out? Like, oh my god, look at all this stuff we have to collect. No way. All right, well, that was uh, the spy who shot me. Oh, you press escape and it just goes back to the main menu. All right. Well, didn't you say you were going to stream? Oh, coming soon. Snow area and online multiplayer. Yeah, uh, Sonic Mania will still happen someday. All right. Yo, if there's a 17th Colossus, you fucking know I'm getting that game. I was already on the fence about it because it looks so nice. It looks really, really good visually. And now that I have a PS4... Also, I heard a, a rumbling that Crash Insane Trilogy is heavily rumored for the Switch, which is pretty neat. Um, anyway, this next game is called Ghosts in the Shortwave. Yo, isn't that that anime? Boz, thank you for the gift sub. Oh boy, this looks kind of neat. Shadow of the Colossus is one of my favorite games of all time, and I would feel bad memeing on it, like, while playing it. Because it's such a fucking beautiful game. Crash on Switch, are you sure? People forget that Crash is owned by Activision. Like, it doesn't have- it's not Sony exclusive, and it hasn't been for a very long time. Would you stream the Shadow of the Colossus remake? I'm debating it. I am. I haven't played it since it came out on PS3 as the HD remaster. Also, this is pretty neat. It's like all ASCII art. There's hints at the 17 Colossus by collecting the 79 new collectibles. Oh shit, I really hope that there is and I hope I don't get it spoiled for me. Because there were so many cut Colossi from that game and it's so interesting reading about all of the... All of the shit that just didn't make it into the game. This is kind of neat looking. I like the colors. This is cool. I think I'm a rabbit. I think I'm some kind of rabbit dog. But yeah, there was a... There's a shitload. There's this one YouTube channel I've talked about before called, like, Nomad Colossus that posts a bunch of Shadow of the Colossus stuff, and it's, like, cryptic and weird, and I like it. 
Yeah, I had a Crash game on the GameCube that I actually liked. It was like Wrath of Cortex or something. But yeah, that would be cool. I'd be down for that. This is kind of neat. I think I just have to find satellite dishes or something. Collect 70 magic, magic eggs to unlock the 17th Colossus. Can you find all 17 shadow eggs? Oh, there's a bird. Maybe I'm a bird. No, I'm not a bird. I'm definitely like a some sort of rabbit that likes solar systems. I've never played Crash Team Racing, and I know that that's like a fucking sin because it's really good. Oh man, these gradients are nice. Sunsets. Am I right, boys? Yeah, I haven't played any Crash games other than the original, uh... I haven't even played three. I played one and two, and I played Wrath of Cortex, and that's it. Oh, and I had a... I had one on the GBA that was like a traditional Crash, crash game, but it was in 2D. And I remember liking that one, but I was a baby, so maybe I didn't... Maybe it's not good. Mike, when were you gonna play Pubga? Everyone knows that PUBG's not the thing anymore. It's all about Fortnite now, idiot. Fortnite's the, the best game ever made. Okay, I don't know where the rest of these owl boys are. No, it wasn't Crash Purple. I remember that being cool, but no, it was like... It might have been Wrath of Cortex ported onto the GBA. I don't know what it was. I just gotta go this way still, I guess. Bruh, we dropping. We're not dropping any frames if that's what you're talking about. What is the name of this game? Uh, the window says GGJ Transmission, but I don't think that's what it was called in the folder. It's very cool. I like the music. I like the visuals. I don't really... I think it's more of an experiment than anything else. It looks like I just have to walk around and find things, but... I mean, I'm okay with that. It looks like more of the level opens up the more you explore. What is this now? I really like... Looks like 1 to 9.5 is shutting down for good, folks. Anyone still listening, we hope you get some comfort from these last few songs between emergency broadcasts. Whatever happens next, know we're here with you. We're here. We're here. We're here. It's called Ghosts in Shortwave. Okay. That was some sad lore. Looks like... Looks like the radio station Jammin 94.5 went down for good. Rest in peace, Jammin 94.5. Next up is I Have No Mouth and I Must Freeman. Like Gordon Freeman? I think you were playing as a polar rabbit. Yeah, whatever. You can't just fucking put the word polar on an animal. I Have No Mouth and I Must Freeman. I told you that's what it's called. Oh, is that the Borealis? Hey guys, I got an early copy of Half-Life 3. Let's check it out. Look, it even makes well, the noises. Well, well, Mr. Freeman. You appear to be in quite the predicament. Yeah, I like the new art style they went with the in this right one. The right man found the wrong place after yeah, all. Yeah, it's, it was a brave new direction Your they took. Your time here runs short, and there is no turning back the clock. The new voice Your actor is really good, too. deliverance could be assured. Well, Mr. Freeman? Mm-hmm. All you need to do is ask. Am I playing? Oh, look at that. I'm playing. Oh, look at that motion blur. Oh, look at that mouse not being locked in the window. That's my favorite thing. Wait a minute. He, like, looks at you. Yo, is that Steve from Roblox? I get heavy Kid Picks vibes from him. Yeah, I heard Valve hired the old Kid Picks team to make Half-Life 3. As you can see, this takes place directly after Episode 2. Uh, there was a bit of a time skip. Gordon did find the Borealis, and now he's on it. And he's here with the G-Man stuck in a time, a time hole. And there's a space egg 
floating off in the distance over there. And he says, all I got to do is ask. So I don't really know what that means. But I can't talk because I'm Gordon. And I think that's kind of the point. And my mouse isn't locked, which is a great new feature. Oh, I bear, I, I'm going to end up banning someone from chat when I try to swing this weapon because my mouse is over chat half the time and there's little ban buttons next to everyone's name. I'm su I swear to Christ I am going to ban someone by accident during this game. I just have to really make sure that my mouse is in the fucking window. <laughs> it's going to happen. I swear, like, my mouse, every time I look to the left, because the chat is right to the left of the game window, it's going right over there. Aperture. Have a nice day. Can I go kill the G-Man? I just clicked on... That doesn't make sense. What are you trying to say? Where are you going with this? I don't understand. What? I don't understand. Yeah, okay. Where are you going with this? All right, all right, I see. Now, well, now I can break boxes, so... Is there cake in this game? Oh, gosh, I hope so. All right, they do break. The new engine is really good, too. I think this is... They, they called this Source Platinum. Oh, I just clicked on a fucking folder and opened it. That's good. I just think it's good. Like, the old Source engine was... It was getting so old. This one has perfect... It just looks great. All the motion blur looks awesome. The graphics are unbeatable. Sound effects, great. I like the whole clicking on things. It's really good. He reminds me of a Gumby character. Yeah, me too. Jazzo, thank you for the gift sub. Oh. What? Oh, look, Braille. Hold on. Look, the A is a lambda symbol. Remember remember Half-Life? Remember lambda? Hey, do you guys remember Half-Life on the Nintendo Switch? Okay. I have to say, get me out of here. I can't look at it. It's fucking... Oh, well, I guess it says right there. What are Hold, you Are you serious? To say... I don't understand. How do you do two taps? Oh, it's it's right it's right click is a long one. What are you trying to say? I see. I understand. <laughs> Indeed. Are you kidding me? I see. <laughs> that was pretty funny. <laughs> but now what? I can't... I can't fucking... The mouse is not in the fucking window. There we... Uh, there we go. I can't... I can't keep hitting him. You can't crouch. I can't... Ca I can't crouch! I just clicked on a fucking picture on my desktop of a dog in a in a bug costume. I can't finish the message. That's the punchline. I guess I guess this is the end. I guess that's I think that's it. I showed you guys the picture of the dog in the bug costume yesterday. Or the other day. I have that on my desktop. I guess that's it for the game. That was kind of funny. I was okay with that. Good job, Nick Cornick. Quit the game. All right. Uh, next up is I am tr I am a tree. You are not. Ha ha. That's the name of the game. I am a tree. You are not. Ha ha. This one sounds very funny, guys. I'm excited. Oh, it's full screen. Give me a sec. I am a tree. You are not. Ha ha. Vinny played this. Great. Great. Mike, why are you copying Vinny? Stop. Stop. 
new. This sounds epic XD. Somewhere at the bottom of Piss Ocean. Okay, that's a good start already. Doc Master, thank you very much for that. This little fucker worm is about to take its first steps towards land. Okay, I'll piss worm. You'll die. Stay in the piss where it's safe. The land is vile. You're going to have to find ways to survive somehow. Why is Top Cheer staying there? I, I enabled that. This looks like Space Funeral. It's a dead piss worm. 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 <laughs> Mike, disable it. It's annoying. Uh, no. It takes up, like, less than an inch of chat. I'm sorry, but I'm, I'm gonna just leave it there. No. It's a dead piss worm. It's a dead piss worm. It's a dead piss worm. It's another one. Welcome to the land. The land will destroy you. The land is not the sea. Do not worry, though, friend. You are very lucky. I will help you. Give me your blood. Good. I will be watching over you. Should anything happen, I will create a new, better you. As you are now, you are pathetic. You will die, but it will make you better. Less pathetic, we hope. Okay. The acid burns you alive. Uh, I guess I'm just blood now. Mike, you should play Space Funeral. I've already played it. I haven't streamed it, streamed it, but like I already know how it's gonna happen. So I mean, like I know what happens, so it's not as funny. I guess I'm just blood now. What is this? Oh my, oh my, how I wish I had some sort of protection from the beasties. Something over my head. Hmm. Yeah, this is definitely, uh, this is definitely Space Funeral-esque. If I keep dying, will I get more powerful? Oh, I guess I can just walk over this now. I don't like that. That looks obscene. I am a slime now, but I long to be a slug. Okay. I liked the intro text, but, you know. You can't interact with these things. So much to do, so little time. Sacrifices must be made. The world will suffer for it, but it must be done. Maybe you could stream Space Funeral 2, Earth Birth. Is that an official game? I think I've heard of that. Don't we all just want to be a slug? Maybe. The trees? Those aren't real trees. They're failed trees. Eager piss worms longing pay, uh, pay no attention to those trees. Most of them are dead. They smell like piss, too. Okay. There's a small valley to the west. I heard anyone who enters it is pelted by the beasties, though. Which is a shame. The beasties really ruin evolution for me. Spanky, thank you for the sub. Or Spunky, not Spanky. Shh. Or, uh, a bladder. How vile. To live your life full of piss. Well, maybe it is better than living in piss. Okay. That's good, I guess. What is that? Is that a turkey? To feel a hand next to yours. It is beautiful. I grow them to feel them. Okay. I don't really have any commentary for this. Just okay. Yeah, big mood. Sorry, Spanky. I don't know. Something, something... Yoshikake Kira. This music's really... It adds to the atmosphere, I think. I became a bladder. And now I used to be a piss worm. I don't know where to go now. What do I do? 
You were a worm before, right? Isn't it so much better to be a bladder? Though we are bladders, we won't last long in the forest. Well, they said to the west there was something, so maybe I'll go to the west. You were mauled by the beastie. Oh, that's fun. Oh, now I'm a fucking giant ass, I think. That's good. I guess they don't attack me now. That's fine. I'm about ready to go to the next game, to be quite honest. Hmm. The skull ruins are on are up on the cliff. People say there are ghosts there, but that's just fucking stupid. All right. I don't get this game. I think it's it's trying very hard to be Space Funeral. Which I think detracts from it. If you haven't played Spa Space Funeral, it's like this. But it felt more fresh? I don't know. I liked Space Funeral a lot. These ruins are cursed. Watch out for ghosts. Only a truly fucked up creature stands a chance. What is Space Funeral? It's like this. Is it true that a Space Funeral is when you shoot your remains off into space? Because I was thinking about that. If your corpse is flying through space, infinitely, because we all know space is infinite. Okay. Uh, aren't the chances that eventually an alien will pick you up and bring you back to life? I died. Now I'm a... I'm a... Demon with letters, numbers. Like, eventually, you know. Now you are satanic. The ghosts will pose no problem, but you are truly fucked up. Bro, you are truly fucked. We are truly fucked. Truly the most fucked creature. Because space is expanding. Yeah, but eventually... I mean, come on, eventually you'd run into a guy. Just some old space fisherman with his net cast into the ocean to catch the, the, the ocean, the, the space whales. And you'd, you'd go into his net and he'd be like, well, gosh darn, it's another one of those humans. And then he takes you your body in and then they pump some young, young potion into you to make you young and alive again. And then you're reborn and they... They keep you on a human preservation on their planet. I'm done. I'm done playing this. Alright, well, I'm done playing this. Uh, next up... <laughs> I have a lot of games to get to. I'm fine. Next up is called... Johan's Farm. Or Johan? I don't know. Is J-O-H-A-N... Johan or Johan? Probably Johan, because I don't think Johan is a name. Either way, Johan's Farm... Gohan. Oh, Gohan. Okay. Rohan. Gohan. Goku. Goku's farm. Oh, this is my favorite type of Unity game, where it just throws you right in. It's called fucking Johan's farm. The mouse is locked, though, so that's good. Can I go into the house? I didn't think I could because it's just a picture. And this is just a picture. That doesn't even look like hay. Hey, it's for whore. Oh, who's that? Is that Johan? Oh, no. I don't want to fuck with Johan. I really don't want to go fucking see Johan. Is he going to be scary? Eloy, thank you for the sub. Is there music? Do you hear that? I'm gonna turn it up a little bit. I think there's music emanating from Johan. Truly, that is a power stance. If you, are, if you can't stand like this, you will never find a mate. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> 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 
find all five bottles of before he gets you. I think he got me. <laughs> I think he got me while I was reading the note! Hold on. <laughs> it's just a fucking slender clone. I can't even quit. There's no, uh, there's no quit button. I have to restart. I want to try, at least try it. I want to at least try it. Come on, Johan's farm. I can't believe that this is a thing. This is more funny than scary. Yeah, you say that, but we didn't get a chance to look at him. Old McDonald fucked you up. E-I-E-I-O. Alright. Why are Slender Clones still a thing? I'm playing it on Twitch, aren't I? <laughs> what is this? What is this supposed to represent? He looks terrifying. That's scary. Okay, so we just gotta find five bottles. That was one. This is great. They, zero environment detail. Like, unlike other Slender Clones, there aren't- It doesn't even look like there's landmarks. It looks like it's just a ground with gray fog! Oh, there's one. And there's, like, banjo music coming from somewhere. I don't know if that's, like, actually location-based, or if it's just playing in either or ear to creep you out. Oh, there's grass. Oh, fuck! Oh, no! Johan! It's literally impossible to outrun Johan. I'm done with Johan's farm. That game feels cursed. Uh, next up is... Lucy Chapter. What? This must be a file name. There has to be, like, a real name for this game. You can't even fucking outrun Johan. Honestly, really, really good game, though. Johan's farm is pretty nice. Okay, so the file was called Lucy Chapter, but the window is titled Third Person Template. New game. Yes. New game. No. I'm sorry. New game. Yes. New game. <laughs> Continue. I'm... <laughs> I'm a child with serious burns in all my body for some reason. My nurse hasn't come back for that reason. I ask for you, nursing service... Your nursing services. I attached to this letter the necess necessary to come where I am. Okay. No buttons are working. Controller, maybe? Controller, maybe? Control- Oh, controller's not where- Oh, this is good. Where I'm. You know what? Isn't this grammatically correct? Necessary to come where I am. That's grammatically correct. I'm starting over with the controller. Maybe that'll work. Yes, it's grammatically correct. It is. I don't care what you say. I don't care. It's I am. It is. It is. I don't care what you say. Does this controller not work? How do you play the game? Oh, what? Okay, now the controller's working. What the fuck? Is that a shovel? Open the door to Alessa. Find- t It's another Slender Clone! What do the buttons do? Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, welcome to Silent Hill 3. What is on her leg? Is that a tattoo? Why can you see it through her, like, stockings? Look at that. I think it's a flower tattoo. There's al- I already see, like, a monster. What do you want to bet? What do you think the monster is going to be? Is it going to be a zombie? Is it going to be a Unity Asset Store default thing? Slender? How do I use the shovel? 
equipments, items. All right, well, I picked up a shovel. Use. Oh, I guess you can't use it as a weapon. Jeff the killer. I guess we'll see. It's a rabbit. It's it's Bunny Bunny Man from Five Nights at Freddy's. All right. Well, that's I mean, can't say that surprises me. Is that a that looks like a that looks like a a thing I've seen before. Katana rabbit. Oh, is that a is that a trash can lid floating in space? Got it. The game. Oh fuck! How do I use the trash can lid? To Central Silent Hill. We're in Silent Hill. <laughs> oh no! This is Silent Hill three. Yo, Silent Hills actually came out. What is? That's a Silent Hill sound effect. <laughs> he, he can't catch me, so what's the point? Wait, is that another one? I see something in the distance. I would love to have two of them chasing me. That would be great. Does this one also have a katana? Yeah, okay. Yo, ain't this that game I streamed a while ago, Lugaru? Is there any run button? There's a jump button. Oh, there's two more. There's two more. This is good. This is, this is a normal person trying to enjoy their normal life when a furry convention is in town. Like, Sun Bunny, you have a furry convention near you, right? Is this what it feels like? One of them has a gun? Wait, really? <laughs> I can't, I can't get over this. How are you supposed to find these emblems? Oh, this is the best way to run. That one has his fists up like I do. Oh, I can do combat rolls. It's just Dark Souls. Look at the fucking stamina and health bars. Oh, I like this. This, this overlapping ground texture is nice. We aren't even halfway through these games, and it's been over an hour. I don't know if we're going to get to Banjo. We'll see. I'm enjoying this a lot. This is the best game I've ever played. I can't... I want to find one more. Look, there's a bus stop. I don't know why they thought this was a good idea. I mean, to be fair, it is called Third Person Template. I got a drink from my Estes flask. I guess it would be an Easter flask, because of all the rabbits. V shield, melee shield. What? Wait, well, well, why can't I use it then? Equipments. Oh, I see, I see. I guess, I guess that's it. Wait, open the door to Ale- What does that even mean? Is there- Am I supposed to get into this bus? Is this bus named Alessa? Alright, I'm dead. I'm done. I'm done with this game. That was a third person template or Lucy chapter. I don't know what you want to call it. Next up is called Monkey See Monkey Flu. Guys, is there such thing as a monkey flu? Like there was a swine flu? And a bird flu. You know, is, there, is this one going to be a monkey flu? Oh. <laughs> Made by Team Monkeys. For Global Game, J Game Jam 2018 Honolulu.
Yo, Darwin, you coming out tonight? Not sure. Heard the flu is going around. You kidding, bro? It's gonna be more fun than a barrel of monkeys. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. I right, count me in. Avoid the flu. It will hurt you. Collect social interactions to maintain your social health. Pay attention, chat. This is important. <coughs> Mike, <laughs> is that the flu? <coughs> oh, is it just like the blue things? Oh, there's a health kit. Yo, this is great. This is really good. I got a social interaction. This is all you have to do to make friends, you dumbasses. Everyone online is like, oh, I'm so lonely. I don't know how to make friends. Fucking do this, idiot. Immune. I am immune to the flu. Wait. You survived the flu and fucked the mainstream. <laughs> what? What does that mean? You survived the flu and fucked the mainstream? Is that because I didn't make enough friends? Like I wasn't popular? I thought this was like a friendly game teaching you about the dangers of the flu, but then they said the F word. Don't say F word. That's alcohol! Fuck the Oscars! And fuck the mainstream! <laughs> this is the real shit! Fuck the flu! Fuck the mainstream! I scream when I touch sick people. Look, I'm almost there. I'm almo I almost made it. Come on. You have to jump to get any of these things. <laughs> no, I'm gonna fucking die. Oh, come on. <laughs> he didn't make it. He didn't make it. <laughs> okay. Well, that was monkey see, monkey flu. Uh, next up is mouse corp. Now, I know that it's core when it's C-O-R-P-S, but if it's just C-O-R-P, is that corp as in corporation? Mouse corp. Why is it over in the corner like that? Oh boy, this game looks great. Mouse corp. You can see it says it at the top. Oh, I like the look of this game. It looks like a fucking headache. Mouse Corp. Oh my god, nice color palette. Jesus Christ. Tearfully, the bravest mice in all of Mouse Corp had left their peaceful holes to harvest the magical wonder berries that powered their beneficent empire. Yet, the war goes on. I feel like we just entered in the middle of a very deep story. I'm, you move with W, A, S, and D. But then you have like a cursor too. Mouse on screen, Mike. Ha ha. Day 368. Hey, Toaster Man, how many days are there in a year? What is that? Is that a mouse? That doesn't look like a mouse. These don't look like mice at all. These look like mice, except they looks like they're crying because it said tearfully. Number one, get the berries. Number two, look out for chomp chomp. Number three, you can do it. I mean, those are the three rules of life right there. You don't need anything else. If you ever need instructions, if you need instructions on how to live your life, check out the enclosed instruction booklet. Roster. Whoa, 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 whoa I didn't mean to do that. I guess I just picked the character. What, what, what is this now? It has tank controls still. It's not in first person anymore. I... What? Did 
Did you ever play Choo Choo Rocket? I haven't. Is that Chomp Chomp? Fuck you, Chomp Chomp. Fuck you, Chomp Chomp. Bitch. I can do it. It said number three. I can do it. Rocket button. Give him the old one, too. I think my character has a gun. This color palette hurts my fucking eyes. I think I just killed one of my own dudes. I, I, I don't know. This is giving me a headache. Mouse, cor my, mouse corpse, I appreciate what you tried to do. The mice looked around and saw a berry bush. Mouse number two is thinking about fields. Mouse number three is thinking about mouse number one. Oh shit, there's a romantic subplot in this game. I hope they get together in the end. I don't- how do you harvest that? How do you get the berries? I don't have any! Get the berries before they go away. I'm trying! Why do they whisper like that? Use the rocket button to pick berries. Oh, it looks like a hand reaching out to grab berries. Yeah, okay, I thought it looked like a rocket shooting away bubbles. Alright. Okay. Yeah, it's a berry. It's- I thought it looked like a rocket ship shooting bubbles out of it. I guess that look- that makes more sense. This music's pretty cool. Click the dog button to collect berries. Can you stop? Why does it run away from me? 1400 hours. Oh shit, we're running out of time. I think I broke it. It only lets me move when I hold down the mouse button now. It's like, okay, it thinks that like I'm locked holding this button. So when I let go, then I stop and harvest berries, but I have to hold it down to move. Let go. See? It's- it got reversed. Oh my god. Oh no, what happened to my- my- my, my berries? I'm done with this game. I'm done with Mouse Core. Alright, well that was Mouse Corpse. The- the sequel to- to Blast Core. This next game is called Dinner with an Owl. So if you've ever wanted to have dinner with an owl, I guess now's your chance. Buckle up. You ready? That's not the right window. Where is it? That's the game grab bag. I don't want to spoil it. Game capture, maybe? Yeah, guys, the superb owl. Ha ha ha. That's not... Can I not capture this game? It's not showing up even under my... Uh, sources. That's so weird. This has never happened before. Usually, things will show up as, like, selectable windows on OBS. Hmm. Maybe this won't work. Window capture usually works, but it doesn't even show up, unless it's this. Hmm. Maybe I can't stream this one. Sound capture. What the hell? Looks like it's not owls for dinner. Oh, that's disappointing. I like owls. That's not it, is it? Nope. Hmm. Can you area screen select? Oh, maybe I can do that. Um... Uh, let me see. Record it with a camcorder. Uh, display capture. Oh, now you can see how messy my desktop is. Oh, no. Can I do an area? I don't want to do it like that. That's so... Look at this. And there's chat. I mean, can you- can you see it when I go like this? Can I- can you see it like this? Is- is this a- is this visible? Cause I can't see the OBS anymore. Okay, alright, then we'll play it like this. English or German. 
Welcome, Mr. Webb. Mr. Brown is already awaiting you. You will find him in his office down the hallway. Thank you very much. Have a pleasant stay, sir. Oh, that's good. That's good. I actually like the look of this game a lot. Wow, the mirror even works. It doesn't work right, but it works. Wait, I need to see if it works. Oh, it does kind of work right. Mr. Brown awaits you in his office. Let's go see Mr. Brown. Hey, it's me, Mr. Brown. Where's the owl? Is that the owl? What the fuck? Mr. Brown? Nice to meet you, Mr. Webb. But you... Did you have a nice arrival? Are you... Okay? I'm fine, thank you, Mr. Webb. You look hungry, though. Business can wait until tomorrow. Well... But before we eat, you have to meet the other guests. Guests? Oh, he disappeared. I'd like to introduce you to Miss April Merritt. April, this is my business partner, Mr. Christian Webb. Nice to meet you. It's a pleasure. But don't think it's quite odd that he's in... This is her daughter, Josie. Hello. Hello, sir. And you already met my butler, Declan, over there. Very well. Guys, what's going on here? Let's have dinner. Am I the only one seeing this owl? Delicious. Declan really surpassed himself. Yummy! What do you think, Mr. Webb? Oh. Oh, no. Do we, do we bring up the owl in the room? Owl Boy 2 confirmed. Yeah, this is kind of creepy. I kind of like it, though. Hmm. I think I'm going to say I'm more interested in why you are an owl. I'm only interested in why you... So, everyone's finished? Yes, Mum. I will guide Mr. Webb to his room then. All right. Should I stay here with Mr. Brown? I'll be right back, okay? We'll see each other tomorrow, Mr. Webb. Just come to my office when you're ready. I've got We've got a lot of work to do. Someone at the window? What? Was there? Your room is upstairs, second floor on second door on the left. What's wrong with Mr. Brown? So now that we're alone, what the heck is wrong with Mr. Brown? Psst. He might hear us. Do you want to leave this place? Of course I do. Let's go then. He's with Josie right now, and I, I won't leave without her. This sounds like Minecraft music. Let's just go get her. What could he do to stop us? You underestimate Mr. Brown. <gasps> Sometimes he lives in the dark. Eavesdrops our conversations. I think he even poisoned the tap water. The only way you could help us is to neutralize him before you fall under his spell. The text is cut off. Oh, you might not be seeing the whole window. You might, you're probably not seeing the whole window. Yeah, some of the, I can't do anything about that at the moment. Well, then let's fucking go get Mr. Brown. Good morning, Mr. Webb. Just hand over the contracts and we can get straight to work. These contracts... Later that day. This is neat. I like this. Enough for today. We're making good progress here. See you later at dinner. See you there. Can you bring up the volume a teeny bit? Sure. There's no sound other than his footsteps right now. These games all have different volume levels too. So that's another thing that happens with grab bags. Why is there like a little gold part of the mirror? Can we play through all of this? I'm immediately invested in this story. We'll, we'll see how long it is. How may I be of service? What's for dinner today? Lamb and kidney pie. Very well. What do you recommend to drink? We've got a decent selection of red wine. Just don't drink the tap water. Why shouldn't I? Well, the water in this area is a bit limey. May I ask you a personal question, Declan? Certainly, sir. 
Have you ever thought about quitting your job? Excuse me? Do you think about leaving this house? It's not that easy. I will take care of it, but I need your help. What should I do? Can you provide me some sort of weapon? Well, there are plenty of knives in the kitchen. MC, thank you very much for the sub. Meet me tomorrow. I have, we have to eat dinner now. Okay. Shit, we're gonna kill Mr. Brown. Mr. Brown, you're gonna get in a lot of trouble! Mr. Webb is a tough negotiation, but I'm confident that we can conclude an agreement. We'll find a solution for our problem soon. What problem? What is this? Your only chance, Christian. Don't worry. It will be over soon. I'm afraid it may already be too late. What, what do you mean it might already be too late? Where? Oh no, I gotta get the knife. <gasps> Nani! Mr. Webb, what are you up to? I... I knew it all the time. But I won't work. But it won't work. You hear me? Mr. Brown. Declan. I didn't do anything wrong, sir. It's me who decides about that. Come to my room after dinner. No, sir, please. Noni. Nandoto. Here it is. I got the knife. Thank you, Declan. Be prepared to leave this house soon. I hope so, Mr. Webb. This is kind of cool. I kind of like this. I got the knife. We're gonna kill him. Should I do it right now? I'm gonna do it. Whoa! It's dead. I can't get rid of the knife. Oh, there we go. Oh, fuck. He just did it. Guys, pay attention to Mr. Brown. He's going to open his eyes, I bet. Let's get out of here. Can we really leave now, mummy? I think it's already too late for him. Hey, you guys remember that first game I played where it said you killed some... <gasps> Not again. I'm so thirsty. Let's have dinner. What the fuck? Welcome, Mr. Gilmore. Mr. Webb is already waiting for you. You will find him in his office down the hallway. Thank you very much. Have a pleasant stay, sir. This place looks strangely familiar. Like I remember it from a weird, long-forgotten past. This is a cool game, guys. Mr. Webb? Nice to meet you, Mr. Gilmore. Did you have a nice arrival? Yes, but... You look hungry. But I'm hungry. Before we eat, you'll have to meet the other guests. Guests? I'd like to introduce you to Miss April Merritt. April, this is my business partner, Mr. Aaron Gilmore. Nice to meet you. It's a pleasure. This is her daughter, Josie. Hello, sir. And you already met my butler, Declan, over there. Very well. Let's have dinner. Delicious. What do you think, Mr. Gilmore? Oh, fuck. Do we get, like, tries until we do it right? Nice Pokemon spoof reference. Thanks. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, it's pretty good indeed. I'm glad to hear that. There's nothing better than a good dinner. Uh, I'm really tired. That's hardly surprising. You had an exhausting day, and we've got a lot of work to do. We'll see each other tomorrow. Just come to my office when you're ready. I'll guide Mr. Gilmore to his room then. All right. Should I stay here with Mr. Webb? I'll be right back, okay? I like this game, guys. Your room is upstairs, second door on the left. Have a good night.
Sleep well, Mr. Gilmore. Yeah, maybe if I don't, like, act suspicious. Why is the daughter the only one with an obscene accent? Hey, how about you let me do the story and you watch? <laughs> that was so rude. That was like the fucking rudest thing I've ever said. So Mr. Webb became the owl? Yeah. I don't need an umbrella in this mo at this moment. <laughs> okay, let's, uh... I don't know. I can't do anything else. I guess we have to go into the office again. Good morning, Mr. Gilmore. Just hand over the contracts and we can get straight to work. Alright. I'll go along with it for now. Later that day... I thought the owl was Mr. Brown. You guys haven't been paying attention. You can't leave the stream and then come back and say, I don't know what's going on. See you later at dinner. See you there. Just joined. Why am I only seeing a portion of the screen? Because I'm capturing my whole... Fu uh, maybe I can fix it. Hold on. If I shrink it down a little bit. Oh, now it's too small. Oh, that's better than it was before. You're just going to have to ignore the little side parts. Okay. This game... Kind of neat. I like this song. As I look into the window over a tired cafe, I see the eyes of a cat in my reflection. I've actually never heard this. This is kind of neat. Is this gonna get you a copyright strike? I don't fucking know or care anymore. It won't get me a strike. I feel like if I skip it, he'll kill me. I kind of like this song, to be honest. Kind of cool. Yeah, this is a very interesting game. I'm glad I didn't skip it. Dogs go bark, they don't go whale, you dummy. Don't think, don't say his name, don't think it. The hoo hoo man. The hoot hoot man. Don't hoot it, don't scoot it. That was actually a good song, I actually liked that. Actually. Not Was I an owl in the in the reflection? I don't trust birds either, desert. How may I be of service? Uh... What's for dinner today? Porridge! I love that! <laughs> what a great- what a great response after seeing the fucking owl in the hallway. I love that! You love it! Carrots, you love it! Uh, what do you recommend to drink? We've got a decent selection of red wine. Just don't drink all the tap water. Or drink the tap water. Why shouldn't I? Well, the water in this area is a bit limey. May I ask you a personal question? Certainly, sir. Do you like working for Mr. Webb? Well, he's a good man, I guess. See you later. I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna try to fucking- I'm not trying to bean Mr. Webb. This is a very fucking cool game. Like, I'm invested in this, so I'm sorry, but we're finishing it. This reminds me of my grandpa's house, and I don't like it. Connor, is your grandpa an owl? We'll see each other at dinner. I might have to talk to him more. I might have to... I can't go down the hallway. Can I look at the notes? Nope. 
I can't go in there either. I think I have to ask him about that. Have you ever thought about quitting your job? Excuse me? Do you think about leaving this house? It's not that easy. I'll take care of it. But I need your help. What should I do? Wait, why am I all of a sudden doing this? See you later. But I didn't... I don't want... I, I'm trying to play the long con here. Why is it these past two grab bags have always had a solid game in them? Because this is the same grab bag. Trust me. I'm, I'm, this is the same one from last time. This is the only time in stream history that I've done like a stream... Look at that. That's not how that works. This is like I'm going to splice two days of streams together for YouTube. Alright, well... I guess I'm just... I think I have to. Can you provide me with some sort of weapon? Well, there are plenty of knives in the kitchen. That should do. Meet me tomorrow at this place. We have to eat dinner now. Maybe I can stab Declan. How was work? Mr. Gilmore is a tough negotiating partner, but I'm confident that we can conclude an agreement. We'll find a solution for our problem soon. This is fucking neat. I really, really like this game. You're our only chance, Aaron. Don't worry. It will be over soon. I'm afraid it may already be too late. The butler did it. One time I dropped a $20 bill and a bird swooped down and flew off with it. <laughs> I'm sorry, Desert. I'm sorry, that's very hard for you. Maybe I should go into the office. I figured out that song he sung is called Black Cat Number 13. I might look that up afterwards. I really liked it. I've got some work on something different at the moment. Please come back later. Okay. Bird's gotta pay rent, dude. Here it is. Thank you, Declan. Wait, what? Wait, 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 okay, what should I say? Should I ask for another knife? Why would I ask for another knife? That song was actually Mambo number five. Oh, was it? Okay, cool. Hmm, why would I ask for two? Dual wield! Stab Declan. Kill Owl and Declan. Stab Declan and the Owl. Dual wield. I'm gonna get- I'm gonna get dual wield. Can you get me one more knife? Here you go. Wait, why? Thank you, Declan. Be prepared to leave this house soon. I hope so, Mr. Gilmore. Alright, so I have- maybe I can, like, store one somewhere for the next guy. That's what I'm thinking. Like, is there somewhere I can hide this? I don't know. I feel like if I store it for the next dude. Kill yourself too so he can't possess you. You can't click on yourself, I don't think. Umbrella stand. Oh, right. Okay, hold on. I was fu I'm fucking smart. I concealed a knife inside the umbrella stand. Guys, I'm smart as fuck. Alright, so now do I kill the butler? Or do I, uh... Kill the owl? I feel like if I kill the owl, and then I just grab the knife with the next dude, then I can run in and kill the next owl. Yeah, I'm gonna kill the owl. Yeah, okay, alright. Then the next dude, this guy is gonna become the owl, so then I'll kill this guy with that concealed knife. Sea of bitch. Bye, Mr. Webb. It's dead. Alright, here we go. Wait a minute. That's the smartest thing ever. Let's get out of here. Can we really leave now, mummy? I think it's already too late for him. <sighs> oh, not again! I'm so thirsty! Let's have dinner. Why does he say I'm so thirsty? I don't get it. Why does their kid have a British accent? Connor, shut the fuck up! Welcome, Mr. Ellis. Mr. Gilmore is already waiting for you. You will find him in his office down the hallway. Thank you, thank you very much. Have a pleasant stay, sir. There goes another one. Yeah, but guess what I got this time? There's a knife hidden inside the umbrella stand. 
fucking right off the bat. Right off the bat. I'm going to do it right this second. Before he has a chance to stick his, his uh, talons in me. Get him, get him, get him, Ellis. Get him. Dead already. No one had a chance to figure out Ellis's plan. Let's get out of here. Can we really leave now, mummy? Yes, my dear. This creature won't detain us any longer. Let's leave this. We'll leave this nightmare. And never look back. And they just look at the camera. You managed to escape after seven days. I wonder if you could escape, like, early. That was really fucking cool. Ellis saved us. A game by Boring Suburban Dad. You know what? I don't think you're Boring Suburban Dad. Graphic story and scripting by Boring Suburban Dad. He did a good job. The music was... Spooky Piano by La La Lo 14, Feelings of Twilight by Shady Dave, and Black Cat Number 13 by Sebastian Romero. Imagine some dad making this game. Yo, but what if you walked in on your dad making a scary horror owl game? That'd be scary. Made for Advjam 2017. Well, that was a cool game. Really, really neat. Um, so let's keep going. Let's keep going. Next up is... I like that a lot. Pacify the chicken. Well, that's a change of tone. You guys... Are you kidding me? I mean... It's kind of similar to the last game we just played, I guess. There's two chickens, though. Is it raining? Sounds pretty bad. I gotta turn it down a little bit. Hey guys, it's raining real bad outside. How are we gonna get back to the car? Ellis, you just saved the day, just so you know. I don't know if you were here for that, but there was a character named Ellis who finally defeated the evil owl demon. Guys? Was that a chicken? What's a chicken doing at the campsite? I must have misheard. Anyway, I need to look for my friends. They must be outside near the car. What the fuck? Is this like a sl is this another slender game but this time an RPG maker and with the chicken? I swear to god. Is there a sprint button? There has to be a faster walk than this. Oh, space. That's much faster. Chickens are terrifying. They're very angry. Desert likes lizards, but apparently he really doesn't like chickens or birds. I don't- I- I'm fucking, like... I don't care about birds, you know? They're fine. They're boring. They're boring. Bo birds are boring. This campfire looks really old. Grass is starting to cover it. There's a lot of screen tearing, too. The sign reads, Forest Campsite, camp at your own risk. Sorry guys, it's true. They just announced it recently, birds are boring. They did, it's official. Okay, well I can walk on the gravel. Is this like a fucking puzzle? What is this? I can walk on the gravel. I can walk on the gravel. It's official. Lizards are in, birds are out. There are some good birds. The birds that, like, sing music on YouTube, those ones are good. Like, you know that one bird that goes... <laughs> That's a good bird. And the one that sings the chocobo music, he's good. Where the fuck do you go? Guys, I'm fucking... I'm done. Pacify the chicken is, is broken. Equip. Erica. Fighter. Oh, man, I don't even have any shields or weapons. Accessory. Body armor. I don't have any of it. Status. 
550 uh, HP already. Is this just a slender clone with chickens? Maybe if I could fucking find out how to leave the area. Like, I, why can't I walk over flowers? This is the most frustrating thing ever. Hmm. I can't, I can see, can't see the car from here. Get inside. What, why could I? That sound again, it's, why could I go in that time? Maybe I had to hit space again? That sound again, it's definitely a chicken. What is it doing at the campsite in the middle of the forest? Would my friends have gone to see why there's a chicken here? Maybe I should see it too. Ow, that hurt. I think I fell down into the quarry. Ouch. Didn't you just go into the tent? How did you fall down the quarry? Oh my goodness, that chicken, its eyes are red. I better get out of here and get some help. I can't get over the rocks. What should I do? Is that some grain over there? Someone must have been trying to calm it down. I should collect and do the same. I'm not even gonna- I'm not even gonna play any more of that. That was Pacify the Chicken. Next up is... Senseless. Collect all 17 of my chicken eggs to get freed from the t forest of torment! Okay, this is, uh, senseless. I have a rocket launcher. And there's a watermelon. Okay. My rocket launcher makes watermelons. Now this is a game. This reminds me of Oblivion. When you could do the thing where you, you make... You could like clone items by shooting an arrow up in the air at an item. And then you drop the item. My brother did that with, with melons in one of the towns. And he made a fucking bridge of watermelons across the water. And it lagged the game to fucking hell. A shotgun. Why can I not shoot? That's a good question. All I see are big pip 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 pink pink letters. Am I doing something wrong? Did I break it? Did I miss something? Is there even a goal? This game makes no sense. It doesn't make fun at all. What was I expecting from a jam game? I'm done with itch.io same this game is a lie this isn't a game well eat ass suck a dick and sell drugs wait when you hit escape what is it what what is that he points it at himself is that how you quit do you click and shoot your your head yep okay all right, well, 99 drum samples by 99 sounds. Good, good shit. All right, well, next game is Solitude. Okay. All right, well, we still haven't hit the highs of Final Fantasy versus Dog, so hopefully Solitude will do that for us. Okay, immediately I really like the look of this game a lot 
What the fuck is that? Yo, I actually really... This is pretty neat looking. I want to get lights like that. Read emails. Hi, yesterday it was really cool, but do not expect anything else. You scare me. You are a freak that cannot be changed. I'm not ready to live my life with such a hermit. Your problems are disgusting and pointless. They are only yours, not mine. Best wishes. That didn't sound like a nice thing to say. E to draw the curtains. She opened the curtains. She didn't even have a pencil and a paper to draw them with. Oh, I got a shoe. Can I throw my shoe out the window? Hello? This is what my apartment looks like. I like I like the the visuals of this game a lot. I mean, this game is gonna make me introspective, Mike. Turn it off. Sorry, you guys gotta look at it. Get this goddamn pork chop out of here. This game makes me have sex. That's a good comment. I like that. I don't know what it means. I don't understand your comment, but I appreciate it. Thank you for chatting in my chat room. My, my song ended. Yo, who, yo, is this, is this the, is this Greedo from Star Wars, Han Solo, a Star Wars story? Oh, look, I can leave my apartment. E, to read the note. Well, first, I gotta put on my hat. In case I see any ladies out there. Attention, before leaving, consider this. Food can be bought online. Toilet and bathroom are overestimated by our society. You don't need to work. You have parents and welfare. Real people are irrelevant. Go surf some social networks. Uh-oh. Guys, watch out. I'm doing it. I'm leaving the room. This is relatable to a lot of you guys on Twitch. Nobody will love me. You won't know unless you try. You'll never know. You gotta get up. You gotta get up on that horse. And you try again. I can't get past the... I can't get past this. No, I want to leave. Alright, I can't leave the room, guys. I'm going back. Nobody loves me. Yes, they do. You just don't love yourself. You have to work on that. Go to... Go to see a therapist. There's no shame in that. Learn about what the problems in your life are and how you can fix them. There's always a second chance. I don't want to leave. Well, you have to. I'm sorry. Sometimes you have to step outside your comfort zone in order to become... To, to... Okay, well, I... No. I actually want to stay in my room. Love yourself. Respect yourself. Wait, did I just, like, put on a coat? Love yourself. Be yourself. I think I put on a coat. Poppy loves you, Mike. Sun Bunny, I swear to God. Yo, is this someone in that apartment? I just didn't bring my pork shop. Or my phone. I'll bring my phone with me. Because my phone is... You can't leave the phone as a millennial without... You can't leave your house as a millennial without your phone. I'll tell... I'll teach you. I got a phone now. Nobody loves me. Nobody loves me. They'll laugh at me. It looks like an eyeball in that E.
Can you throw? Oh no! Guys, I can't I can't play this anymore. I don't know what to do. Close the door. Oh, maybe I have to close the door. My phone fell into the void. Nobody loves me. They're gonna judge me. That's not for me. Nobody loves me. Nobody loves me. I better study something. Nobody loves me. Nobody. I'm that thing you said about needing to study something, that was a good, that was a good message for your brain. Shut the door. No, shut it. It's closed. Now if it doesn't work, I'm just gonna quit the game. No, my Neko Atsume save file! No! That's a, a metaphor for losing things in public. If I can't pass this right now, keep walking. You can't walk past the sign. You can't. Maybe I'll go this way. I'll just keep going off to the side of the sign. It just looks like a bunch of dots now because I'm walking away from it sideways. Bye. Bye, room. I'm going out into the real world. Okay. That's not for me. Alright, I'm done with this. Wait, what's that? Oh, that's the, uh... That's the words. Okay, I'm done with this game. Alright, well, I'm done playing with this. Uh, let's go to the next game. Next up is Space Co-op Co-op. Well, I don't have a partner, so this better be single player. Sun Bunny sent me this one. So if it doesn't work, we know who to yell at. I genuinely do not know what that flag is. Space co-op co-op. No, this is fine. What the fuck? I, I genuinely don't understand how to control this character. You can, like, propel your body around a little bit. And you can grab onto things. This is a nice cover, though. Wait, what? Pooper scooper. Over. What, what am I checking off? I, I just checked off alphabet spaghetti. H for helmet cam. That looks like Mr. Saturn's dad. I don't get it. Lo-fi beats to explore space to. Did you guys hear that they they copyright struck the, the lo-fi music to do homework to? And she's gone now? I'm making it. I'm almost out of here. You checked off everything. The game's done. That's a good point. Pour one out for the anime girl that did her homework. She didn't get a good grade. She failed. No, but it won a Grammy. Who's, what won a Grammy? Grab the sausages. I want to grab that dog. Mission complete. Kiss a fellow customer. I guess I did an achievement. Yo, there's shit over there. This is great. Nothing to tea here. What if the Oscars won a Grammy? They wouldn't, because fuck the Oscars. Yeah, you hit Q to grab stuff, but it has to be, like, within range. And I don't understand. <laughs> I think you just have to, like, do a checklist of things, I think. I don't know. I don't really know what the, the objective is. Also, why do, they're just going to put that channel back up. They'll just make a new channel. I'm done with... I'm, I'm done. Alright, I'm done playing this. I mean, you can grab whatever you want, but I don't get the point. I got... Yo, man, I got a bunch of weeds, dude. 
Art critic, pull art off the wall. Okay. Well, that was uh, that was Sun Bunny's game. Thanks for space co-op quap. Next up is a game called Stilt Fella. Now that's a good sounding game. Mike, I did a DK thing. What did you do? Stilt fella. Well, that is a stilt fella. I will I will say I have to use a controller for this one apparently. Start. Is that Ellis? Oh god, are you kidding me? All right, so each trigger controls one of the fucking stilts. Oh. Press Y to reset. Oh fuck. Oh, this is bullshit. Oh. oh. Just nice and easy. Nice and easy. Ah, yep. Oh. Oh, <laughs> oh this is really hard. I just want to beat one level. I don't care about anything else. Just let me beat one. No. This is really difficult. This is just no. the mobile game Daddy Long Legs. I've never heard of the mobile game Daddy Long Legs. I only play Battle Cats. No. Ah! No. Yeah, what if there is no level 2? Target time is 80 seconds. Maybe, maybe small steps. Small ones. Stop. Stop it. Okay. Left leg. Oh. Oh. Pick up both sticks. You can't. Okay. Oh. This is so difficult. Wait, if you... Okay, you can hold the, the control stick forward to lean forward without even lifting up one. So maybe just do this. Oh! Sazagia, thank you very much for the sub. What? How does this work? Wait, hold on. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Each stick controls one arm. I've, I'm a fucking dumbass. I'm a dumbass. I, I figured, like, you just had a fucking... Your body to control. You could lean forward or back, but it's both... Okay. I'm a dumbass. Uh, how did you not realize that? I don't know. Guess I just didn't. Guess I'm a fucking dumbass. Oh, well, I'm making it up. This is worse than flying the plane in Banjo. This is very hard to control. I don't understand how you would even attempt to do this. If you put it forward, it shifts the weight backwards. So maybe you do that. Oh, yeah, you gotta, you gotta go like this. Mike, remember, triangles are the strongest shapes. They don't have anything on dodecahedrons. Triangles are fucking wussy babies. I almost made it that that time before the last time. Oh, ha, ha. Let me do this. I wish that this had music. I think a nice country song would go well with this game. Oh, fuck. No! Whoa! No, 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 no! <laughs> Shit! He's eating it! Uh, Jazzo, thank you very much for the gift. Sub! Yo, what song would go well with this? I know what song would go well with this because this is just monotonous. I have the perfect monotonous song.
What, you guys don't like this song? What's wrong with this song? Oh, look, you can change the camera angle. Oh, wow, this will make me feel like shit. Oh, fuck. <laughs> this actually works great. Ow. This music. Bitch, come on, bitch. No! Oh! <laughs> oh! Guys, this is impossible. I can't do it. I can't do it. Also, I can't, like, see chat. Hold on. Now I can. No, we're just gonna keep doing it. We're just gonna be quiet. Quiet! We're just gonna sit here and be quiet. No! Oh, I had it though! You're on level two? I did start this game up to see if it worked. Did I beat a previous level? I don't recall doing that. can't select that. Maybe the first level was just like a fucking take a step forward thing. Oh. Try quick tappy taps. Oh. No, this is the only song that works for this. I want to know what level 14 is. Oh, also Tofu, thank you for the sub. We've listened to it twice now. There's no extended version on YouTube because God fucking forbid. Come on, I got it this time. Once you take that first step, it's just about, okay, once you take the first step, you like kind of build up some momentum and then it's kind of just, hold on, I got, I, I can do this. One step, then you, okay. What's the story here? Ellis got to go pick up some milk at the store. And his his dad's using his car. And his feet hurt a lot and he can't touch the, the ground because he's allergic to concrete. Oh, Amco, thank you very, very much for the bits. I appreciate that a lot. Really, thank you. That's really, really incredibly generous. I don't know what I do to deserve this. I'm fucking playing a cowboy game. Trying to walk across a gap. Can't Ellis just milk himself, though? I'm talking about our friend Ellis, not the cow that's dead. Are you telling me Ellis has a cowboy hat that he wears? Ellis, you have a cowboy hat. Don't lie. Fuck, hold on. I got this. All right. Lean forward a little bit. Uh, oh, no. Oh. No! Lean forward a little bit. Is it still a cowboy hat if it says Australia on it? That's a very good question. I need to mod this game so his death sound is replaced with... Oh! Oh! Please try isometric view. I got this. I got it this time. 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 No! 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 Oh. Alright, I'm just gonna hold forward and I'm gonna do it like this. Oh. What if I do like... <laughs> Wait, hold on! What if I do a cartwheel? Oh. 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 
Hey, no, I can do it. This is fucking advanced level stilts. Advanced level stilt fella. Uh. No, it's not gonna work. Come on. Yes. No, don't be a bitch. Come on, get back up. Come on, Ellis. I missed the owl game. Speedrunners hate him. Speedrunners hate him. I, I am determined to fucking do this. I really am. It's just like two fucking more feet. I can make it. It's not that fucking far. Did you finish the owl game? Yes, I did. And I liked it. It's not that fucking far. <laughs> Do a flip. I'm about done, though. I tried really hard. Uh, this is incredibly difficult. Like, you hold forward to lean forward, but then you have to immediately, like, tilt backwards to fucking move your stilt so you can step on it. It's really hard. Oh, fuck. I'm, I'm done. This is my last try. This is my last try. I can just start going backwards, I guess. Why is the left trigger not working? Okay. All right. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Next game is... I almost just closed OBS. Next game is... Because uh, that, was, that was fucking close. Um, I'm fine leaving it on that. Uh, the Bleeding. Oh, The Bleeding. Sure. Made with Game Maker Studio. Don't mind if I do. Wow, this, wind this window is incredibly small. I think I'm just going to play it on OBS. Oh, good. This reminds me of Faith. You came too. V has come too. All right. Well, this is just cursed again. You came too. You feel intense pain in your body from the wounds on your body bleeding. Your hands are tied, but the knot is so bad that you are loosing hands untying. You are loosing hands untying him. Um, your hands are tied, but the knot is so bad that you are loosing hands untying him. You need to stop the bleeding. Uh. Uh-oh. Is that my blood meter at the bottom? I sent you this. Oh yeah, Sunbunny sent me this too. You just gotta find a dang band-aid. This guy walks real slow. Just keep going this way, I guess. Blood? Is that you, John Wayne? Is this me? Hey, <laughs> hey! You close the door. You close door. How long? You close door. How long? This music sounds familiar. What is that? Hoomst. What is that? Fire. Come to me. Come. Oh, no. I see him. Fire on fire. Ah! I... 
I don't I don't know what to do. I hit escape and the game closed. The game just closed. No warning, no one anything. Oh, thank you for the sub, McGladle. All right. It just closed. I hit escape, seeing if I could pause. Yeah, all right. Should I give that one another try? That was very confusing. You reading? This game's for nerds! It didn't close. You just won. All right. Okay, let's go to the next game then. There's three more games, so I think that that will leave us time to play some banjo. Maybe. We'll see. The Journey to the Party is the next game. The Journey to the Party. Level 9. That's not the game. That's the dog. All right. Uh, Wazda plus mouse to move. Left click to interact, it said. Oh. Okay. I'm already excited to play this one. Except the fucking... <sighs> Hold on, I gotta relaunch it. I accidentally moved the window down too low. And if I try to drag it, it just goes into the game. Unless I pause it. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's frightening. Okay, we're good. Time to go to my party. Oh boy, there's a ghost. Should have saved this one for Halloween. Jeez. I don't know if I'd want to go to this party. Wow, those hands are spooky. I refuse to invite them. Oh no, not a spider. It can jump. I'm going to jump on its back. It's got a button. Okay. I mean, this is pretty good. What is that? I better watch out. This witch seems scary. Is this by the uh, that dude that did the other, the like sea, the, the undersea flea market thing? And the pirate ship? I don't know what that is or even if it's dangerous. I like it. Undersea pick hell. Monster, sea catch up that. We're almost there, everybody. Wait, sorry, you don't all have bodies. Here we are. Please, God, no, don't sue me, Beach Boys. All right. <laughs> Next up, fucking Mike Love would have come for me. Next up is the Midnight Pack. Uh, yeah, the one thing you don't want to mess with is Mike Love. Uh, next up is the Midnight Pack. I like I like Beach Boys too, but don't want to risk it. The Midnight Oh Park, the Midnight Park, not the Midnight Pack. Play, play, play. Yo, is this a picture coloring book? The frame rate doesn't seem... It seems like it's running at, like, 20. This is really fucking cool looking. Holy shit. Mike Love is in chat. Oh, no. Collect the five pine cones before the gentleman gets you. Can you find all seven of my nighttime eggs? Click on the red mushrooms that represent the prime numbers. This is actually very cool looking. I feel like this is just a walking simulator, but I'm, I'm, I, I like walking simulators if they're neat. I'm like very small. Yo, remember when you were a baby and you were this small and like swings was over your head and shit? That must have been weird. Mike Love is the evil Mike, like how Darkiplier is the evil Markiplier. Good, good, uh, good comparison. Is that a snail? This is very cool. Haha, ha, what if I was in the park, but I was only two inches tall? Haha, ha, what would you do? 
Don't be afraid to get weird, haha. <laughs> Yo, is that cat? Is that a neck all? Is this slender? Is that gonna kill me? What the hell is that? Something's- This is very cool looking. I like this. Yo, the trees have eyes. It's kind of like... Kind of like Yume Nikki-ish. This is very cool. Yeah, it's like got a, like a chalk aesthetic to it. I don't really know what the point of the game is, other than maybe just walking around this environment, but I'm alright with that. I don't think I've played a single walking simulator tonight, so I'm okay with this. Yeah, these trees look like they would taste like chalk. I don't think I would want to eat them. Uh-oh. Evil. Despair. That's me. Yo, that's Tails. What the fuck is that? It's like a pony. It's like a rabbit with pony legs. The music's very cool, too. Son of Slender. Hello? Oh, okay. Yeah, what is- there's like a cat. It's weird because the- the way that the stars are moving along with me kind of makes me feel like I'm indoors. It kind of is like reminding me of like a- like a bowling alley or like a-, a like a laser tag arena. I don't know if that was the intended effect, but it's kind of neat. I really like the staticky sound in the music too. I found it. I had to find that yellow pixel on the tree. I beat the game. Or an observatory. You guys remember that early South Park episode with the dude who kept calling it a planetarium? Planetarium. Yo, well, let me go into this planetarium. Planetarium. He just didn't pronounce the T for some reason and they just didn't know why. Hi Mike, how are you feeling? I'm feeling great, how are you? What's up, Royals? I don't know what- I, I might go to the next game, but it's not because I'm, like, I don't like this one. I think this is great. Shrimp, thank you very much for the sub. I don't know. I think I went to a planetarium once in, like, grade school on a field trip. I haven't been to, like, a museum in a really long time. I'd love to go to the science museum in Boston. I haven't been there in, in ages. They got those balls that you can touch and then they make you electric. Then again, I'm so elect- Guys, the other day I was fucking grocery shopping and I tried to open up one of the freezers and I got electrocuted so bad. After the other day when my headphones literally broke because I fucking electrocuted them so hard, I think my powers are getting a little dangerous and I'm kind of scared. I've been- it's been real bad. I can't control my powers anymore. Alright, well this was a very cool game. I'm- I'm done playing this, but I've- I think it's nice. I like it. I'd like to explore that a little more, but... Um, next up is... Our last game is Words Must Die. I'm kind of sad this grab bag is over. This was a really good grab bag. And it will be on YouTube spliced with the uh, Fox game and the Dog vs. Final Fantasy game. Words must die. Sensitivity is extremely high in this game. As the sun rises over Open Grave, Arizona, or is it Body Heap, New Mexico, all these towns run together these days. Like blood in the gutter, you squirt at... You, uh, <laughs> you squint at the window or the stove. What, is this like a text adventure? Do I shoot? Do I shoot by choice? The window. Oh, okay. 
Bang! Your bullet shatters the greasy window. Windows suck. They only cloud the truth. You head for the door. Next to it, it next to it hangs a white hat. Boom! You shoot that goddamn white hat and cram the uh, the black hat on your grimy head. White hats are for goody two shoes and mama's gals, and you ain't either. You turn to the door. Kaboom! You blast the lock off the boarding house door and kick it open. The day of reckoning has arrived. You stomp out onto the streets and you head for Nasty Jack's saloon. Oh, this is cool. This is neat. This is a cool concept. Oh man, this is bringing back memories of fucking Fistful of Frags. Ellis and me, we used to have a lot of fun with that game. I remember the little saloon you could go into and I'd like sit at the piano and play music. Pass the whiskey. Pass the whiskey. Hammock, thank you for the sub. I haven't played it in ages. Pass the whiskey. Pass the whiskey. You fire a warning shot into the saloon doors and kick them open. Everyone cattle rust... Every cattle rustler and bank robber in Nasty Jack's gang gasps and stares. You sneer at the poker table or the piano. You sneer at the piano. You blast a hole in the sheet music for the dirty gal ragtime surprise. I'm here for my revenge, you shout. Then you unload your whole cylinder into the wall. There she stands, looking smug on the piano. The woman who stole your man. You especially hate her. Where? You especially hate her fashionable cigarette holder or glittering hair brooch. I don't know which one of those would bother me more. I feel like it would be this one. You shoot it right off of her well-proportioned head. She turns towards you and purses her lips. Oh, it's you, she says. Yep, you really... Uh, yep, you reply and fire a bullet right past her perfectly styled hair or shapely hips. It was, I was out wrestling cows, you say, while you were out wrestling my man. You fire two shots into the ceiling. <laughs> with a, <laughs> how appropriate that you were with your cows, she sneers. She lifts the bottom of her dress to show you her legs because... Boone sure loves my shapely calves. Furiously, you shoot at... Ooh. A vase of flowers. I don't want to hurt nobody. The flowers, which once decorated the piano, now decorate the air with fragrant confetti. The celebratory atmosphere puts you in the mood to shoot... The man stealer. More glassware. Oh shit, did I kill that dude? Pow, pow, pow! Glass things all around the room erupt into shards. The slippery vixen runs out the door. You fire at a glass coyote figure. The way the word coyote is spelled bothers me so fucking much. Suddenly, down the stairs comes Musty Eustace. Nasty Jack's dynamite boy. There's a lot to take in in that sentence. Suddenly, down the stairs comes Musty Eustace, Nasty Jack's dynamite boy. He's howling and screaming and holding a chicken drum. He'd be holding a stick of dynamite. He's a fucking dynamite boy. Thank God you missed the dynamite. You do, in fact, clip him in the arm, though. He drops the stick of dynamite and reaches for his whip. You miss! Eustace snarls and whips you across the face, chasing you through the crowd of... Twirling waitresses. Whoa, whoa! You stumble backward through the crowd, firing wildly. Eustace pursues, cackling. I should have waited to blow up your outhouse until you were in it. But you live and aim for... or But you dive and aim for his foot! You shoot him in his- yes, his boot! It's explosive, it explodes! Disgustingly, Eustace wails and collapses onto the floor, minus most of his leg. He's down for the count, though maybe not dead. So you fire some uneasy shots at... the nearest shadow. Bam, bam, bam! 
Someone bounces up from behind the, the bar. It's Betty Books, Nasty Jack's accountant and financial planner. She did your taxes once, badly. Look who's back, she sneers. She glitters with diamond brooches. You shatter her largest brooch. Blood spurts from the shoulder. She howls, scrambling to onto the bar for a gun. You blast the gun out of Betty Book's hand. Ah, oh, she cries. You, Im you impoverished imp. But now her weaknesses are exposed and you can aim at all her remaining jewelry. Your expert aim shatters every single ruby and sapphire encrusting Betty Book's but leaves her alive. She flees to the saloon. She leaves, flees to the saloon in terror. You aim at a celebratory round at the poker deck. Yeehaw! Nasty Jack himself descends the stairs. I see you've chosen to reap the whirlwind, he says, spinning deftly while also twirling his pistols on each finger. He raises five pistols on his right hand. Holy shit. This is getting intense. Pow, 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 pow! You hear, you hit four of his tiny pistols as he twirls to the piano, but his largest pistol remains. I see you no longer practice tornado gun foo, he sneers. You fire a shot at his, his twirling pelvis. But the bullet pings off the rhino hide jack jock strap. You forgot the rigorous standards of tornado gun fu safety, he sneers. You dodge his hurricane of uh, re retaliatory shots by tumbling across the floor and fire at his lungs. <laughs> the shots bounce off his camel hide lung guards. You've fallen so far since my training, Jack cries, and shoots your lung, which is in inadequately protected. You fall, you f uh, fall firing wildly at his gallbladder. Bam, bam, bam! Pow! He uh, pirouettes to the doors, bullets pinging harmlessly off his jinx hide gallbladder guard. I should never have let you leave my de my desert jo dojo alive, he cries. You don't have the guts to kill me, your master. He takes a final shot at... Uh, you take a final shot at his weak armpit guard. If you could see his the bullet in slow motion, the way it threads itself between the exotic leathers would be extremely cool. Nasty Jack clutches his wound and staggers. He turns to escape. You shoot his head. He collapses on the floor. Your bullet misses. I can't believe it, he groans, blood dripping from his nasty lips. But you're losing blood too. You raise a, a wobbling arm and aim at an oil painting of a fancy horse. Or you and Nasty Jack, yeah, symbolic. You blast a hole in that nasty painting. Ah, you cry. Ah, cries Nasty Jack. You both bleed in, in, ignominiously on the floor. As your vision fades, you fire a final shot at your own feet. The bullet flies straight through your foot and into Nasty Jack. But as your lifeblood drains, you wonder, is this fearic victory worth it? Death only begets death, and you've been begot. Well, I guess I lost. Can't even go up the stairs. I liked this game. This was neat. I'm not going to play it again, but that was very cool. You gotta live with your choices. You gotta live with your choices. I fucked up. It's my fault. I just want to see if, uh... If I do something different, I'll go to, like, a different place. If, like, you can start Nasty Jack's... No, you end up at Nasty Jack's Saloon either way. Okay, well, that was very cool. I, oh, look, all the words stay there. I liked that. That was very neat. Um, cool idea for a game. Anyway, that was it for the grab bag. Uh, thank you very much for watching. That was really fun. That's going to be one of the longer grab bags, too. I think once it's all put together, it'll be, like, 2 hours and 45 minutes or something. Um, either way... I started really early tonight, so I'll probably get to go to like 11.30, maybe midnight at the latest. But uh, yeah, we'll do some Banjo-Kazooie Nuts and Bolts in a couple minutes. I just got to start up my Xbox and stuff. So give me a couple minutes for that. Thank you very much for watching, and I will return very shortly.